When I got Bello, I had no idea about raising a Shih Tzu, or any dog for that matter. And now, after two years, there are so many things I wish I knew before. So I decided to make this video listing down nine things you must know before you get a Shih Tzu. Number one, get a Shih Tzu pup from a breeder. I would highly suggest everyone to adopt a Shih Tzu, but in case you decide to purchase it, get one from a breeder. Make sure you ask him all the questions regarding the authenticity of the breed and any possible genetic diseases. You can ask the breeder for a health certificate too. He may even give a written guarantee of the Shih Tzu's health and a clause within it may also mention about refund or exchanging the Shih Tzu for a different one. Avoid buying from hobby breeders or pet shops who carelessly breed dogs to maximize their profits. Number two, they crave people. Shih Tzus are very social and adorable companion fur babies. They love being indoors and are quite attached to their owners. They demand constant love and attention from their family members. They will follow you all around the house and would want to sit on your lap all day long. While they can manage being alone for short periods of time, it is not advisable to leave them alone for longer periods as it causes them separation anxiety. You can watch this video to know more about that. Number three, Shih Tzus are high maintenance. Be prepared to shell out enough money to maintain their most striking feature, their long, shiny, soft fur. You will need to invest in high quality canine shampoos and conditioners. You will have to brush them daily to avoid tangles. Even with this, they need professional grooming every now and then, which adds up to the expenses. Number three, they need high quality food only. This is especially true of pups as they are growing. Their specific nutritional needs are met by a high quality diet, whether ready made or made at home. This means no economically priced food, as it is nothing but unhealthy, harmful fillers with no nutritional value. Whether you opt for ready made food or learn to prepare, you have to invest in serving them high quality foods. Number five, Shih Tzus are stubborn. Even with the adorable eyes and gorgeous appearance, your dear fur balls have a streak of stubbornness. They will not respond if there is nothing in it for them. Known to be good as lap dogs and a wonderful companion, Shih Tzus can be a little difficult to train, so you will have to be patient and consistent with their training. Number six, Shih Tzus bark a lot. Shih Tzus are a little more vocal than other breeds. They bark at practically everything, right from a stranger at the door to anyone else passing on the road, and even the delivery guy. This could be for several reasons, such as to draw your attention, to alert you, out of excitement, or when they are lonely. This makes them wonderful watchdogs. They will certainly not attack, as they are great companion dogs. Number seven, Shih Tzus can't take intense heat. This is because they develop breathing difficulties due to their small faces. This can escalate to them having a heat stroke as they can't pant heavily to lower their body heat when the temperatures rise. Also, their thick coat is well suited to cold climates. It is advisable to keep them indoors when the heat outside is too much. Number eight, not advisable to have them with toddlers and young children. While Shih Tzus do tend to get along well with children, Owners with toddlers should ideally not bring home Shih Tzus. This makes them prone to getting injured unintentionally due to their size. Number nine, prone to coprophagia. Most dog breeds either eat their own or other animal species. However, Shih Tzus are somewhat likelier to indulge in this tendency called coprophagia. The two ways to avoid this is to keep a constant vigil over them and not let it become a habit and most importantly, cleaning up the feces after they are done and not walking them anywhere close to public toilets and littered areas. I hope these points help you to prepare and take better care of your Shih Tzu. By the way, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to our channel. See ya!